So here we are going on the inside of this awesome, great size. It's small, but it has lots of great features. It makes it feel bigger. So in the front, nice window there, window with the room darkening shade right there, a huge U-shaped dinette. Now you can put it down to a bed. You also can swivel the table like so. So if you're a bigger guy like me and you have a hard time getting back in and out, whatever, that makes it much easier. Nice little ledge over there. And remember, when you put it down to bed, it's a big bed. Bluetooth speaker, so you can be enjoying the tunes inside and out. Coat rack right here by the front door, your controls, and it's pre-wired for a solar panel. Huge stainless steel sink, so you can put hot stuff or sharp stuff, you don't have to worry. Nice room underneath there. You have a bunch of drawers here, and more over here, along with your two-burner stove top. Microwave and even more storage up above. So that's nice. You have a spot for your TV and which side am I opening right here? 10.7 cubic foot all electric refrigerator. So you can get a frozen pizza in there. It's more efficient and it's going to be just, you know, overall a nicer experience for you. Now, sliding door right here divides the bathroom. It's a walk through bathroom, which helps make it bigger. That way you can change clothes or whatever. Skylight. And your antimicrobial shower door curtain, it wicks off the water as it goes back in, so you don't have to worry about mold or anything like that. One piece shower surround with your wand. On this side, it has a curtain to separate you from the toilet area. And you have your vanity and a window. More windows equals it feels like more space. Now, in the bedroom, this is the cool area. So you have a couch that can also be a bed. On the bottom and then you have a flip up bunk above that now you could use it just for storage use totes or whatever and or for sleeping also has totes underneath the couch so it's easy to take those in the house load them up the couch also flips up out of the way so if you just want space there you can do that extra storage on the end spot for another tv and the big windows back here so it really feels open and you can get a nice cross breeze extra USB ports and outlets. And with the bed on the slide, you have a lot of space to walk around the end. A little bit less space on the end part, or in the sides. We also have the totes. Take them into the house, load them up, and then you bring them back out. Just a really nice size camper. Lots of great features. And it's available. So give me a call. Big Ben, 715-614-2121. Hey guys, this is Big Ben here, Camping World and Gander RV, and this is an awesome Brand new 2024 Salem FSX 176 QB HK. It's an awesome small camper, about 4,300 pounds, 22 or 23 feet, a little over 23 feet. So it's a great size, but it has the bed on the slide. It has a bunk type situation in the back, but it's much more usable than just bunks. You'll have to wait until you see it. But it's a really cool camper, so let's get right to it. So here we are at the front. You have your 120 pound LP, nice chip guard right there. The big power awning goes all the way down the camper. It's going to keep you dry. It's going to keep you out of the sun. And it's going to make it more enjoyable when you're sitting out front, enjoying the weather, listening to the trees, the birds, the kids play. Maybe the sound of the river flowing nearby. There you go. That is awesome. That's what camping's all about. Now, on this camper, it does go all the way through here in the front, the storage. But on this side, you have your flat top grill. I love the flat top grill because you can cook anything on it. Just think about just about anything, and you can cook it on a flat top grill. So don't have to worry about that. Outdoor shower. People tell me all the time they love the outdoor shower because they use it for their kids, their pets, tools, knives, whatever else. So it's a great thing to have. You have your 110 outlet. So if you're like me, I put a table out here. I hook up my coffee maker. I'm under your nice power awning, and uh, just run it from there. So it's easy and convenient full-size spare hopefully you never need it but if you do easy to get to pre-wired for a backup or a monitor camera and then the new lippert ladder system so it only has the two holes not the six holes in the back of the camper get your expandable ladder pull it down you do your maintenance that you need to do two to three times a year on your roof and then fold your ladder and put it away so that's the outside let's go take a look at the inside 